It's safe to say that you don't remember your first hiccup since it's probably occurred before you were born. It's typical for a developing human fetus to have hiccups in the womb. So why do we get hiccups? That's coming up, so stay tuned. Practices that might irritate your diaphragm, such as eating too much or drinking too much, can make a person prone to having hiccups. Strokes are brain tumors involving brainstem, and some chronic medical disorders are reported to cause hiccups. The process includes a sharp contraction of muscles used for inhalation, the diaphragm, muscles in the chest wall, and neck. This is counteracted at the same time by inhibition of muscles used during exhalation. Here the back of the tongue and the roof of the mouth move upward followed by the clamping shut of the vocal cord also known as the glottis. The closing of the glottis is the source of the eponymous <gasps> sound. Hiccups are seen in a wide variety of animals. These observations suggest that hiccups may be left over from the previous stage in our evolution. So the question of the R is how to get rid of them. You should inhale and hold your breath for long. This will help you to get rid of them. Please do like, share and subscribe to our channel. Comment down with your suggestions and until next Thursday, thanks for watching.